Um, I do spend a lot of time with Cisco. And, you know, one of the areas where I think they've really excelled is within um, their CX or customer experience, um, you know, portfolio. And, you know, this has been a catalyst to transitioning from selling hardware to, to subscription and software and that sort of thing, right? Mm -hmm. But one of the biggest challenges is around partner engagement. And if you think about Cisco, they are not a direct selling organization. They drive 95 plus percent, if not 100 percent of their sales motion through the channel. And so it's, it, it's important that they uh, put together programs that are scalable, that are repeatable, that are predictable, most importantly, that are consumable by their, by their partners because their partners are the ones that are doing the integration, that sort of thing. So um, Cisco Lifecycle, uh, Lifecycle Services builds upon its overall um, CX portfolio of solutions. And what it's doing, it's, it's taking, again, that CX approach, leaning into its depth of experience and extensive partner network to deliver um, solutions that are scalable and predictable. And what I really like about it is it's it's not like, hey, stand up a network or you know configure security posture. It's based on business outcome. Yeah. So they've defined several business outcomes. I believe that's going to grow over time. And it's really focused on you know helping customers solve solutions and pain points. And again, doing it in such a way that it's massively scalable. It leverages a lot of the learnings that maybe from a managed service perspective, a mid-market company just couldn't access because they just didn't have the checkbook, you know, to be able to, to engage this going out. So it's like taking those learnings, that capability and really scaling it out. And I really like it. Um, I, you know, I, uh, I tweeted about it when it was announced a week ago. And, um, you know, if you want to learn more, go hit my, go hit my Twitter feed. And um, I also spent time with executives, uh, you know, before the announcement and I, there's a quote um, in their payload there, you know, for the launch, but, this is another area where Cisco really differentiates itself. And so I felt, you know, I, I felt it was important for me to sort of jump in there and support it. But um, don't know if either of you or Paul caught it or if it's relevant to your areas of coverage, but I think it's pretty powerful. To, to me, what I, I love about Cisco and I liken them to Microsoft a few years ago and uh, Oracle of, of late, and that is, you know, um, Cisco had this kind of made this killing in enterprise, large enterprise networking, right? Um, and they lived off that. And they've gone through this they, and they continue to reinvent themselves and expand their market share, right? So what they're doing is they're bringing, you know, large enterprise practices and learnings down into uh, downstream into a market that can now consume these services. So they're expanding their addressable market wisely, right? They're yeah. doing very easily, very simply for their customers, um, and they're continuing to add value. And, you know, they, they've gone from a, a networking company company to an everything company, mm -hmm. um, which to me is just, it's fascinating to watch. They just had a partnership with, uh, announced a partnership with Nutanix as well. That I also, tweeted about that too, and I thought about you when I when I sent that tweet, Matt, or that X, or whatever we call it these days. <laughs> but that's that's another one where they, you know, they continue to kind of bring themselves, you know, further and further into the. I don't want to say the mainstream because they've always been in the mainstream, but it, you know, expanding their their uh, addressability and and consumability. So to me, that is a fantastic story. Yeah, um, I, it's one company that I have no doubt that you know five years from now they're going to be a relevant part of any discussion having to do with enterprise IT. Yeah. 